sincerely hope that this bill will provide an opportunity for healing at least for some of the victims. New Hampshire Attorney General John Formella is asking state legislators to approve a bill that would set aside $100 million to establish a fund to settle sex abuse claims against the Youth Detention Center, now known as the Sununu Youth Services Center. We believe designing and implementing this type of a claims resolution, resolution process that provides an option for victims it's just simply the right thing to do. Nearly 450 former residents have sued the state, alleging various assaults at the hands of more than 150 staffers from 1963 to 2018. But under the bill, only people who lived at the center from 1980 and beyond would qualify for compensation. I think there's room for discussion on what, what this date would be, but 1980 is the best rough date we could come up with based on what I've seen on the criminal side and, and where what I, based on that information, what I've seen is kind of where these where these events and allegations focused around. Claims would need to be filed within a year starting in September and payments would be capped at $1.5 million. Anyone who files a claim would also waive their right to seek further compensation in court. We oppose the bill, not in concept, but the way it's written. Attorneys for the victims want changes to the conditions. The idea that somehow the victims have to abandon all their other rights in or as a price of admission to this process is a non-starter. Now, this bill is not set in stone just yet. There are several workshops planned for the coming weeks to make any adjustments if needed. I'm, I'm confident that, that uh, we're going to make some real progress in turning this bill into something that the victims will use. In Concord, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.